Hey, 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 welcome back to my channel, guys. So right now, I am definitely doing like a scan of my computer because for some reason, when I was filming this same video over and over again, um, I don't know if somebody was hacked into my computer. I had to turn the Wi-Fi off because it just kept resetting. Like it would wait and then it would reset. It would wait and then it would reset. So I just did do a like a new update on my computer, but I'm just over it and I'm now in the market for a Mac. I just swear the devil just be like waiting to like make sure I'm aggravated to just go on a killing spree. Cause it's like, really? Anyways, so right now this review is supposed to be about my Hair Like Maggie. My review on my hair that I bought from Hair Like Maggie. So I first found out about this wonderful young lady who has a store in my home base or hometown of Newark, New Jersey. And I found out about her hair store through Malibu Doll Face. So pretty much I was buying my hair from Indique whenever I would buy quality bundles. I only knew about Indique. It was commercialized or franchised, so to speak. And I didn't trust getting my hair um, that's that expensive from anybody else. My price tags would always run about $1,000 for my hair. So I wanted to make sure I got it from somebody quality that I can trust. In case anything happens, I can always go back to that store and say, hey, listen, take this back. It's not working. But... Um, this is a young black woman and I'm all about supporting my sister. So I did see a video from Malibu Dog Face about a year ago and it just took me a long time to kind of like try and recognize it and try it. So I watched a couple more reviews and I was like, you know what, sis in my hometown, she's African American like me, I want to give my sister a chance. So I'm going to try out her bundles and see what pops. So this is a girlfriend of Mayno. May know the rapper um, who's on Love and Hip Hop this season, Love and Hip Hop New York. So you may catch Maggie on that show, but I'm definitely going to be rocking her hair and getting it installed so you can reach hair like Maggie. She has an Instagram, Twitter, all that good, good, good. Um, so let's get into it. I decided to do a body wave. I haven't done a body wave in like ever. So I decided to roll with four bundles and a closure. Um, I have Cambodian hair. Which originally I did not ask, I asked for, but then I was told to get Peruvian. So I was like, okay, give me Peruvian. Then I ended up getting both Peruvian and Cambodian. Don't know what that was about, but we'll let it rock for now. Um, so I ended up getting a 24 and a 26 of Peruvian, which is awesome. It's totally fine. I noticed that the Peruvian is much more closer to African American hair, meaning that it's not very silky and thin. It's thick, very good hair. Not to say that silky hair isn't good, but silky tends to be a little bit more thinner and stringier. I like a thick type of hair. So this Peruvian hair kind of like got me more like Brazilian hair. Um, I got the Peruvian hair in 24 and 26. The Cambodian bundles I got in 28. So this is definitely more silkier than the Peruvian. I think you can definitely tell the difference between the two. I'll let you see for yourself. So definitely the Cambodian, Peruvian. Um, I'm going to try them both out. Don't care. Initially, my first thoughts on the bundles, um, not a lot of weight. I was unhappy about that. The reason being is because the 24-inch seems to feel just as thin as the 28. So to me, it's like if I'm getting four ounces of hair or almost four ounces, my 24 ounce bundle shouldn't feel the same as the 28. As a matter of fact, the 28 almost feels heavier and it could be that it's a different type of hair. I'm going to give it a chance because either way, sis gave me a great discount for fun, four bundles and a closure or a frontal, $650. Not bad. So a little bit thrown off by the weight because I'm definitely wanting to feel quality, but it does feel like a pound of hair. I'm not going to lie, but when you feel the bundles individually, not really impressed. Last but not least, I did get a body wave. The type of hair was not indicated. Um, it does look towards the texture of a Peruvian, 
closure. So this is the 18 inch frontal 360. So this is going to be a band that goes around my head. I'm definitely going to do a, a review on the install. So I'm going to drop this off about 24 to 48 hours to my um, installation tech, my hairstylist, and she's going to customize it and then do my hair the next day. So this is a 360 frontal, the first time I'll be doing a frontal. And to me, that's going to be like almost a pound and a half of hair, more than enough. But this is an 18 inch. It's called body wave. The type of hair is not in indicated so I don't know what kind of hair but it does look closer to the Peruvian to me that's good because the Peruvian will be in the middle with the 24 and the 26 and then the 28 the so Cambodian will be under so you can't really tell the difference I feel like once I co-wash this hair it will be fine um so it's not really a big deal love the casing that it came in didn't get too much tissue wrapping which I think you can kind of sacrifice on when you got people spending thousands of dollars on hair you can sacrifice with some tissue paper, girl. But the flyer is definitely a price tag or a menu of all the hair that you could ever ask for. I'm definitely going to be going back. There's definitely a hair care guide, which I think is very important. Also flyers as well. Important packaging. I think this was neat. Plus, sis did give me a gift bag. This looks much neater when she gave it to me, so... <laughs> um, Put a lot of cosmetics in here very cute bobby pins i think this was really neat a couple of cosmetics so i can't be mad sis was definitely generous and very nice with the gift bag because she didn't have to do that so definitely put a bunch of cosmetics in here i think that's cute even if i don't use it my daughter should definitely you know play around in it so very cute. I'm definitely going to be doing a second a review on the installation of this hair, but I definitely got about a pound and a half of hair for 300, excuse me, $650, usually Indique runs about a thousand. So I'm excited to see how this hair works. Plus Indique doesn't have a very large variety. They only use Indian. Um, as far as I know, I don't see anything else outside of Indian. So excited to get this hair installed. Um, while I'm sitting here doing this though, I'm doing this baby foot peel. Now, I do this in between pedicures. This is very, very good. Um, this basically is an exfoliant that does all the slowing of the dead skin, but it does take about seven days for it to take effect. So you put on these booties, right? It's under these socks. I put the socks over it because I still have to walk around. You can't walk around in these things because you will slip and bust your ass. But... <laughs> I put the socks on over them and I leave them on for about an hour. Once the hour is done, I do wash my feet and in about a week, you'll see all that dead skin fall off and you will have some baby feet. So in between pedicures, I do the baby foot. This is really, really good. I do recommend this. So I'm gonna be trying to get myself together for the new year, you know? New weave, new feet, new me. <laughs> also, one more thing before I go, guys. I'm trying to make this quick because I don't know if this video is gonna shut off again. I promised to do a perfume review, and the weird thing is, I bought this collection. I gotta show y'all. Remember, you guys, I told you I was gonna buy the, oh, the Kaleidoscope from Bath and Body Works, right? And I was gonna do a review on it. I finally got the lotion. When I went to go order some more because it smells amazing, it disappeared. So I checked and checked and checked. It, it's no longer there. I don't know what happened to it. So maybe it was just a test run for a fragrance because it does look kind of cheap. It doesn't look official official. But this perfume, Kaleidoscope, from Bath and Body Works and the lotion, I went to go order some more because it smells very androgynous, very like um, the fragrance Bulgari, very masculine. It smells amazing. And when I went to go order some more, when I found out how, how amazing this is, I went to go order it. Bath and Body Works was sold out. But they weren't even sold out. You just can't order it. You can't find it. It says 404 page not found. I'm going to check for it again. But I was going to tell you guys to go pick it up. But it's like as soon as I ordered it, that was it. So maybe it was a test run. I don't know. It's supposed to mix with your own body chemistry and give you this amazing scent. It puts me in the mind of... What is it? It puts me in mind of Bulgari. It does. And Lovely Dreamer. But Lovely Dreamer is a little bit more feminine. This is definitely more masculine. So between the dry shampoo and this, this scent, I love it. 
But anyways, I will come back to you guys later with a review. Uh, I'm, after the installation, I'll show you guys the review of the installation. Hair Like Maggie, definitely going to be somebody that I visit again. And um, this synthetic gray is not working for me. You know, with my job, they about to have me all the way gray. But let me got, let me know. <laughs> Cause I done had a couple glasses. I gotta go to bed. My job stressed me out today. Let me know, guys, what you think um, about hair like Maggie. I haven't been able to find a lot of reviews outside of Malibu Dollface. I'm not going to front. I do think that was kind of like um, sponsored, but we'll see. I'm definitely excited about the installation. Set my appointment for next week, and you guys will be getting a video soon. So I do apologize about the late review, but I still made it. <laughs> I love you guys. I'm just stressed. My job is trying to kill me. But I'm just survive. survive. <laughs> All right, guys. I'll talk to you guys later. I got to take it down. I'm so tired. Love you. Bye.